What is up everyone, Mr. Aviator here bringing you another episode of The Sims 4 Legacy here on Aviator Games. And you guys, today is another day in November, which means it's Simvember here on Aviator Games where I upload a brand new Sims video every single day in November. I hope you guys have been enjoying Simvember, Simvember so far. If you have, please slap a like on this video, guys. Continue the support. Let's go for over a thousand likes on this video. But today, this is technically the first day that these two are living on their own. Last episode, they kind of just got settled into their house and, and slept overnight because they didn't get here till like 10 p.m. But now this is their first morning here and they had to decide what are they going to do with the rest of their lives. Now, we know that Lindsay is a smart girl and we know know that Ryan wants to be more of a jog type so we just have to get them to join a career so that's what we're gonna start working on right away get them into their careers and figure out what we need to do to keep their professions you know doing well and you guys gave me some wait I guess we're not wanted here uh, oh that's no oh, that's Dina no you're wanted here okay so let's see let's go to athlete that's what we want to be we want to be an athlete for Ryan I'm sorry Dina we didn't answer the phone or the door we're just so busy get our life started we just moved out yesterday give us some I don't know, space some air please <laughs> okay so come on Lindsay you have to get a job too now I'm not gonna do any of the interactive jobs just because eh, those aren't my cup of tea so we're gonna find her something else now a tech guru or a secret agent I think we're gonna go along the lines of a tech guru because she's a smart girl and enjoys being I don't know brilliant and I think tech guru is the the career for her so let's check what does she need she needs a level 3 programming skill and look at this guy she's already a level 3 tech guru oh my god okay so practice programming let's have her do that today what does he need daily task workout why isn't he a level three? He should be the best athlete of them all. Okay, so let's have him work out. That's his daily task. A lot of you guys were telling me to change up this room a little bit, and I kind of agree with what you said. You said you didn't like these little posters. You thought that was kind of stupid on the wall. And I guess, you know, I agree with you. So what I'm going to do is do what you guys wanted and put a whole bunch of mirrors all over this bad boy. Um, let's see. Is it under decorations? I think it is. Mirrors. Okay, so let's go with these big triple mirror things right here and just place those right there. That way Ryan can look at himself as he's working out and admire his own body. So get in there, Ryan, and start working out. If you're going to be a professional sports player, you got to get in shape. Now, what is his fitness level at? It's a two. Yeah, he's nowhere close to professional. Maybe he could be the mascot. Maybe. That's a big maybe. Because you have to be pretty buff to even be those guys. So, you have a lot of work ahead of you, Ryan. A lot. So, we're going to let him work out. We're going to go check Lindsay. She's programming. And you know what? Since this is a programming room, let's give Lindsay a little module thingy. Um, one of those little sim things. And make her more focused. So, that's inspiring decor. Let's give her this one. This is the focusing decor, and it looks pretty cool, not gonna lie. Um, does it come in different colors? Can I, like, color palette this? I can't. And then I also want to put a confident one, which I think is this blue one. Playful. Where's confident? Confident, confident. Confident. Yellow, guys. This looks pretty cool. I thought there was a blue one, though. I really did. Okay, so let's put a confident Aurora, a Aurora light in here, I should say. Um, and then that way, uh, Aura. Is it Aura? It's Aura. Okay, able, enable the Aura, and let's go downstairs and enable her Aura, and it should be a really productive house, so let's do that. Okay, so she's focused. He's going to feel confident. It's going to help him work out. Isn't it confident for working out or no? Is it not? Yeah, he's getting confidence from a good workout, right? It's boosting his confidence. That I guess it doesn't boost your... Uh, oh, Energized. Energize, guys, right? Is that what we need? I thought confidence would help, but uh, maybe it's energization <laughs> that helps. Is that a word? Confident, environment, focusing, playful, inspiring, romantic, inspiring, focusing. Oh, maybe it's not. There is no energy one, I don't think. Oh, that sucks. Okay, well, confident it is then. Let's grab this yellow bad boy again and place him right back. Okay, so let's enable that and go ahead and be confident, my friend. Okay, so he leveled up. He's level 3 fitness now. She's trying to get to level 3 programming so she can get promoted on her first day at work tomorrow. Look at how hard she's working. Don't you just appreciate that? I appreciate it, Lindsay. Look at her. She's like, this is a difficult job, but somebody's got to do it. <laughs> okay, so let's have her work. I think we'll have them work for a little bit until they can each get their levels up a little bit, and then we will go have some fun. That's the whole point of life. You gotta have fun. Right now, our program is only a one. Heading towards a two. 
I think we got to get that three programming and also get video games up a little bit. So her skill for programming is done, okay? And one more skill, one more skill. That's all you need. Okay, let's go upstairs. Oh, he's done working out. Let's get him to run with his chest out on the treadmill. Come up here. Run with your chest. Let's turn the music volume down a little bit. Medium volume. We don't need to be busting it that much. Look at him. He can't even run on a treadmill, and he wants to be a professional athlete? I don't like where this is going. I don't think it's going anywhere fast. Uh, so let's have him use this toilet and take a nice long shower once he's done working out. Oh, maybe he'll actually hit a... What is he, a three right now? He's a three. He's almost a four, though. Okay. Okay, we can work with that. So let's have him shower, and then he won't look like a douchebag anymore. We'll probably turn off this radio. Uh, his morning workout is done. Now, I think Lindsay made breakfast. She did. So let's put the breakfast away. And then let's serve dinner. Let's make Frank some beans. So she'll serve breakfast, and Ryan will always serve dinner. That way it's a fair household full of, uh, I don't know, fairness and equality for all. Okay, so she's about to get her programming skill and done. Okay, so now what she can do is play some video games, maybe some Sims Forever, as Ryan makes up supper. Tomorrow's their first day of work, though, I think for both of them. Tomorrow's Wednesday. So, yeah, he works on Wednesday, and then she also works on Wednesday. She works Monday through Friday. He has more of a messed up schedule. He works Sunday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday. So he gets Mondays and Thursdays off. Kind of a sad... Oh, he just dropped the salt and pepper shaker into the Franken beans. Oh, that's going to be extra salty. I don't want my food to be that salt. Oh, God. Okay, so let's grab a serving of this. And then when she's done playing some video games, she can come in here and grab a serving. Um, and then they can chit-chat with each other. That's something that they haven't really done yet today. And chit-chatting's necessary. So come over here. Eat. And then you guys can chit-chat. So maybe joke about aliens, share brilliant ideas, heartfelt compliment, Briner's day. Um, but what else can they do? Funny. Let's maybe... Talk about politicians, all that good stuff. So that's what they're going to do. <laughs> okay, let's go look at their friendships really quick. So Ryan is her brother. He's an outgoing dude, okay. And then there's Dina. She knows Don. Where did she meet Don? Uh-oh, Don's a troublemaker. Okay, let's see if Ryan knows any girls. So Ryan knows Haven uh, and also Sierra. So that's it, just those two. And those are his options. We gotta get these people to go out there. They're single young kids. They're like, tw we'll say like they're, they actually just graduated high school. We'll say they're like in their 20s, like 21, and they're they're looking to have a good time. They're looking to go out to the club and just, 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 I you don't know, have fun. <laughs> okay, so they're chit-chatting. Are they, are they chit-chatting? It doesn't look like it. Chit-chat. Chit-chat with each other. Tell her a dramatic story. And then a funny one. And then do an impression. What is this? What is this? Chat with Lindsay? Oh, they're chatting, guys. This is good, because we need their social skills to get better. Plus, we need them to be more entertained and become closer as siblings. They're friends, finally, but uh, they weren't. They didn't grow up like that. Uh, let's have him clean. Oh, she's cleaning that up. Very good. Okay, why do you still stink? Why do you have this aroma about you? Okay, was that in the fridge? Does the fridge stink? Well, let's have them both watch some TV. This is more, I don't know, more bonding time. They can both watch cooking cable, and that way that they, they can also level up their cooking skills since they live on their own. they got to cook all their own food now, so I think this only makes the most of sense. Just relaxing, watching some TV, working on their careers. They're the future generation. They got a lot of money from us, their parents, to have a better life, but in order to keep this lifestyle that they got used to, they have to work hard. They still don't get to sit on their butt. Maybe two generations from now, those Sims can just sit on their butt all day and do whatever they want, but these are Generation 2 Sims, and they still gotta work. As you can see, they have this lavish house that's nicer than most houses, but they still, they, they only have $4,000. They need more money, and they need to be able to expand the house and, and look into more things in the future. Uh-oh. This is all stuff that we gotta, we're gonna weed this. And we're gonna water, and we're gonna weed, and we're gonna weed, and we're gonna spray this for bugs. Okay, we're gonna have, uh, Ryan's gonna be a little bit of a green thumb, you know, he's gonna be that athletic jock dude, but he's also gonna love gardening. It's gonna be kind of a funny, a funny little thing here. Oh no, good tomato bush. Okay, but it's not very happy. Ryan's gonna have to take care of these bad boys. And then there's this garbage, he can throw that away. Ryan likes the outdoors, and that's what we're gonna, we're gonna take from that, okay? Like, he loves playing professional sports. He also loves the outdoors. Oh my god, how many? Oh, we have these trees. Oh man, these trees aren't looking really good. We have to keep these up. We have to keep all these trees up. This is a lot of work for Ryan. He's going to be doing this all night. Okay, let's see. What is she doing? Okay, stop. <laughs> stop playing on your computer. It's time to go to bed. Okay, so Lindsay, go to sleep. 
Uh, Ryan, what time do you work in the morning? Uh, 2 p.m. Okay, so he can stay up later, getting his bushes and plants done. He's spraying for bugs. He's, you know, he's watering. He's weeding. Oh, man, these bushes are a mess. These potted plants are destroyed. Okay, now he's starting to finally water. Oh, my God, this is disgusting. Oh, they're starting to turn green, though, guys. Look at Ryan's doing it. He's bringing them back to life. I thought it was hopeless. This, this, these looked like they were pretty much ready to be sold. But Ryan and his green thumb, he's, he's doing it for these plants. And look at, they're happy again. Well, starting to become happy. They're not as happy as could be, but... <coughs> they're on their way. <laughs> okay, so halfway, and then this is a little more than halfway. See? Okay, he's got a lot of work to do. He's going to have to do this every single day just to make sure that these bad boys stay alive. But I, I think that he could do it. I think these plants are really going to like Ryan. I'm not going to lie. We can harvest this all too tomorrow, but I don't want him to stay up too late because he's got work in like 12 hours. Still got to water all these trees, spray for bugs, weed a little bit more. Gardening, especially a garden this size, this is a long, long project. But I guess they can take turns kind of doing it. This can be like their passion project. It basically shows how responsible they are. Can they keep a garden alive? If they can, they get to keep our money. If they can't, they have to give it all back and move back in with mom and dad. <laughs> that would be horrible. Okay. Come on, only a couple more to water. God, he's been doing this like all night. He's been doing this probably like seven hours, six hours. Maintaining a garden should not take this long. Okay, that tree's really coming alive. Oh, these trees are really cool looking. Yeah, we gotta keep these alive, guys. We really gotta. Oh, wow, that looks so good. Okay, I don't know why his skill's not going up. There we go, he leveled up. He's a level two. Is there anything else he has to do? No more weeding, but he can spray for bugs. Because he doesn't want any of his plants to get ate by bugs. So let's do that really quick. <laughs> look at him spray for bugs. Okay, well, those plants look fine now, but it's almost five in the morning. Ryan, you were up way, way too late. And he's still spraying for bugs. Oh, he's so angry. He is so uncomfortable. But these plants look amazing now. Like, look at this. Look at this. They're, they're the happiest plants I've ever seen. They're like the greenest plants I've ever seen. Okay, Ryan, let's go check on your sister. She's probably about ready to wake up. It's 5.40 in the morning. Let's have her use this, take a nice long shower, and then pretty much eat some breakfast and head off to work. She's got earlier work than you do, so you don't have to worry, but you should have been in bed a while ago. The sun's already up. He is gardening his life away right now. God, there's so many bugs. Why do we have to spray for so many bugs? Okay, now that he's done taking care of the garden, I think it's time to just quickly relieve his bladder and then go to bed and pass out until he goes to work. This is not going to be a good day for him. And then he'll probably take an energized shower so he can go to work with his ideal happiness mode. Uh, what time does she start? 10? Okay, so we're going to have her do a little programming before she goes. So practice programming once you're done eating. And Ryan's ready to pass out. He is so tired. <laughs> and he is passed out now. Okay, so once he wakes up, it'll probably pretty much be right, right away time for work. But I'm going to try to get a brisk shower in. So that way he can be energized when he goes to work and just be 100%. What time does he work tell? Uh, 9 p.m.? What time does she get done with work? I think it's 6, 7. Okay, so not too big of a difference. Um, okay, so where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Okay, go program. She's got to go to work in two hours. So we want to make sure she's in the focused mindset. So that way when she goes to work, she can maybe push for a promotion on the first day of work and become a level four in the tech guru career, which would be amazing. We need a new oven. I, I just remember that. We really desperately need a new oven. Okay, so she's feeling focused. She's programming. She needs to get that video game skill up. She's pretty much flirting with the skills right now. Uh, let's head upstairs. Uh, how are you doing, Ryan? He's got this little skill above his head. I don't know why he's got that above his head. Um, how tired are you? Very tired. Okay. Uh, he'll have to eat at work just because... Oh, what time is it? 10.30. Go, 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 go. You're late. You're late for work, Lindsay. Okay, so let's have her work hard. Let's go focus on Ryan. And now he can just sleep. He can just sleep pretty much until work starts. Oh, he is tired. Okay, go shower really quick. Take a brisk one. Maybe you'll wake up a little bit. Uh, I know, I'm sorry I kept you up so late gardening. I didn't mean to, buddy. I really didn't mean to. Okay, he's feeling really hungry. He's feeling fatigued. Um, but it's pretty much time for work, so I, I don't think he's going to have a chance to eat. So off to work you go, buddy. I, uh, he's going to come home so angry because we're going to work him so hard at work, and he's just going to come home and hate his life. But I don't know if the garden needs any maintaining today because he did so well. Ooh. Oh, he, they could be watered. Let's harvest all. We could harvest all when he gets home. Let's have her do this. Uh, so click this, harvest all. That She's already feeling tense, so maybe gardening can help. So let's harvest everything. She's acquired the gardening skill, and that's good. 
And this is something Ryan doesn't have to do when he gets home. She can harvest all of the fruits and vegetables, and then she can water all the plants as well. Oh, look at these. They're, they're like, somewhat happy. They need more water, though, to be even happier. And then she could take care of herself, like, maybe use a nice, uh, toilet, and then have some fun by playing some video games. She didn't get promoted, so she's got to be close. Got to be very close. Very close for her. Ooh, God, he almost got promoted today. He's feeling pretty tense, though. We're going to have him come in here, eat some franken beans, uh, and then we're going to have him go upstairs and probably just call it really early tonight just because I feel like that's what he should do. He had a really, really, really late night last night, and it looks like Lindsay might have a late night tonight. She's, she's trying. Look at all this food we got. Oh, my God. How much money is that? 230 bucks? How much is this? Oh, 80 bucks. <laughs> How much is this? So, um, $52. Okay, so some of these are worth more than others. 100 How much are the strawberries worth? 200 Oh, my God, we're making money off these vegetables. What the heck? Look at this. Look at how valuable these vegetables are. They're superb quality. What the heck? How did we get superb quality food? We're like such beginner gardeners. Okay, that's awesome. Well, now that she's done watering, she can use the toilet, play some games, and... Then she's probably got to go to bed because it's getting pretty late and I don't know. I, I, I just, this day has just flown by. Clean out the spoiled food. Open this up. What's spoiled? Oh, the egg spoiled. Dang. Okay. So we'll have her eat that after playing just a little bit of video games. We want to get her gaming on. What does she need to do? She needs to program and she hasn't done that yet. So she's going to have to do that in the morning. Let's wake her up or I mean, stop this. Have her eat. Clean out the spoiled food. Go to bed and then hopefully everyone will be asleep. Oh, he's already resting. He needs to have some fun in the morning, and I don't know. We'll have to have him play or watch some TV or something. I don't know if he can work out being this upset, but he should wake up pretty early because he got an early jump on sleep. Okay, so there we go. She's done with that. Now wash those dishes and scurry up to bed. Oh, man, this has been a very hectic day. Getting these two started on their careers, not the easiest thing that I've ever done. But I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, remember to slap that like button, Lemonheads. And if you watched the whole thing, comment down below the struggle, because we struggled in this episode. If you comment down below the struggle, I know you watched the whole video. But until next time, remember to take it easy, live and squeezy.